FIFA 20 is out, and if you're looking to buy some Ultimate Team coins to get your dream squad, make sure you check out my sponsor, u7buy.com. They provide a cheap and reliable service for coins and accounts. Link in the description. Use your code Haber and get yourself an extra 5% off when you are at the checkout. Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. We are a minute 40 away from uh, Division Rivals. I think they call it like the calculation period, where they calculate, you know, what rank you've got and then distribute the packs. It usually takes about 10 to 15. Minutes. It is currently 7:43 a.m. and I'm really excited because we're about to open the first division rivals rank one rewards of FIFA 20. Hopefully, we can get some good stuff. If you do go on to enjoy this video, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here. You'll get a bunch of videos like this in the near future, and uh, <laughs> we're just a minute away. All right, five seconds now. Let's see. Is it going to give us the reward straight away, or are we going to have the calculation period? Uh, it does say tournament closed. Now, I'm guessing it will say, yep, yeah. calculating rewards. We've got 9 minutes, 55 seconds to wait, so it looks like we'll get rewards at 5 to 8 in the morning. I'll see you guys in 10 minutes. Here we go. Come on. 6 seconds, 5 seconds for the first Div Rival rewards. Rank 1, Division 5 for myself, and I have some more rewards as well to open up for you guys. So, as I have got... Uh, weekly rewards. Yep. Can we claim them? Here we go. I've got rank five. So I'm going to go with untradeable rewards. This gives us four premium uh, jumbo premium gold packs, two 50k packs and two 35k packs as opposed to tradable, which gives us two uh, 15k's, 150 and 135. So I'm going to go with untradeable. Click confirm. We get 195 rival points. Rank one in division five for div rivals hopefully i have all these packs we can get something decent um it says re redeem foot champs access uh i've qualified yeah okay so i've got two thousand points that's a, that's cool we've got a, we've got enough now for foot champs um so we've got like i said four 15ks two 35ks and two 50ks let's start off with the 15k packs and see if we can get anything decent from these uh hopefully we can end the video with at least one or two walkouts that would be nice uh first one's actually going to be something this is going to be a board drop in the first pack i'll take it belgian what's it going to be goalkeeper it's going to be... I actually can't remember this guy's name. Castiles, there you go. Uh, an 8 3 rate start off is actually decent. I'll take board drops. They are very nice indeed. Um, unfortunately, no board drops at the front of the pack. It's going to be a, a duplicate that I think is tradable. Yeah, okay. Um, then these two fellas, I don't think sell for anything. Um, I, yeah, I'm just going to discard these guys. Don't think they're selling for much at all. If I discard anyone that sells, I do apologize. I am not too savvy with SBC plays at the moment. Um, I haven't really done too many SBCs, so I've not really been paying much attention. Engine. Second pack is not going to be a board drop, so I'm going to skip that. Um, when it's not a board drop, all I'm hoping for is Eder Motau, Furlan Mendy, Wamba Saka. Um, any of those three would be fantastic. Or maybe even like a Jamie Vardy would be pretty cool as well. Um, let's swap these two over and get the coins for discarding them. Nothing good in that second 15k pack, but the consumables are great. And obviously, if you guys are doing like Rotor Glories, for example, or you're just not spending thief points and stuff like that, I'm sure that the consumables from these packs are going to help you out massively as well uh, and give you a good start for having like squad fitnesses, having position changes, uh, and things like that. I'm sure you guys are going to be, um, I'm sure you guys are going to be uh, enjoying these packs for that. So. Three packs in, had one board so far, but we're about to move on to the big packs as well. So I'm excited to move on to, you know, the 35s and the 50Ks. Uh, last 15K pack now is not going to be a board, but I don't really expect anything from those, to be honest. I don't really expect boards. Um, I expect, you know, oh, a Florenzi's not bad, actually. I think he's selling for a little bit. He's like 5,000 coins. I'll take a Florenzi. That is a decent pack right there. And an Eric Bai, who I think is also selling for a little bit, if I'm not mistaken. He's a duplicate and tradable anyway, so it didn't really matter. Um, I'll quickly swap over the rares. I think we're all dupe and tradables anyway, and we'll discard the rest. So, two 35k packs now, which is going to be pretty cool because I know they have the, uh, the black uh, doors. So, this could be good. It's going to be at least a board. Walk out! we got a walk out. Come on! It's going to be Belgian. Centre back. Oh, you really want to see left wing there, don't you? You really want to see left wing, but I'll take an 87 rated Elder Vreld. That is a fantastic start. We've got the first walk out of the video. I'm happy with that. I would have loved to see left wing. I, my heart would have gone crazy if we got left wing there. I've used Hazard recently, actually. It's fantastic in this game. But 
that is decent. Um, I think that we're going to get a Wants to Watch SBC like tomorrow when Wants to Watch comes out. So he's going to be fantastic to use for that. Uh, we've got Lodi, who we ne if we need a, 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 you know, a left back from La Liga, we'll definitely use him because he actually tears me apart when I use him, uh, when I play against him, sorry, in, uh, in Rivals and stuff like that. So uh, we'll swap those three over. Only one of them is tradable, sadly. But no, it's a good start to the special packs. Second 35k pack now. Can we get back-to-back -back walkouts? That would be surprising. It's, it is going to be something... It's going to be an inform. What's it going to be? It's going to be French uh, striker. Ooh, who is it? Thuram. I don't think that's too bad, actually. Uh, he's got a half-decent looking card. 86 pace, 82 dribbling, 80 shooting, 81 physical. Uh, some decent stats. So we've got a walkout followed by an inform. That is some good form right there. That is, that is a couple of decent packs. Um, I don't know if he's selling for much. Only three-star skills um, and pretty weak actual attacking stats. He's still like a 20k card, to be fair. So I'll store him in the club and I'll hold on to him. Um, we've got ourselves a few players here that we can quickly see we can get a discard from. Fellaini, good to see him back in the game. A little bit of Fellaini. Um, all right, so we've got two 50k packs now. Can we get another walkout on this account? Because this will be very successful if we can. Um, first, a 50k pack now. It's going to be at least a board. It is going to be a board drop. That's what it's going to be. It's going to be... Danish goalkeeper. It's going to be Kashbush Michael. We already know what that's going to be. So, uh, well, I mean, we'll take it. 83 rated. We could have, for example, like a Rashford in here and a Martial. Both would be incredible if we could get either of those. Um, no, we do have a Fabian in there. So, it is two boards in one pack. Not the worst in the world. I know that the rest of these, apart from Sabitza, are actually dupe and tradable. So, I'll just discard those. Um, now, for the second and last pack of my account, I'm going to jump onto George and Sam's accounts uh, and open up their Div Rival rewards as well. So, can we get a walkout in the last pack? It's not even going to be a board, actually. That is a disappointing end. Hopefully, it's saved by like a Furlan Mendy or an Adair Militao or something like that. No, not at all, actually. Um, that is a really, really poor 50k pack. I actually know all of those are dupe and tradables as well because I open a lot of gold upgrades. So, let's go and open up George and Sam's accounts now. Now it's time for George's rewards. I think he's in Div 4, uh, rank 1. So he gets 115k, one uh, rare players pack, and one mega pack. Actually, he might be in rank 2 here. Um, in fact, I think he is in rank 2. Yeah, he is rank 2. He's in Div 4, rank 2. Uh, he wanted tradable rewards, so I thought we'd, uh, we'd open these and hopefully get him something good from these. So we've got 115k, 135k, and 150k. Let's see if we can get him anything decent. So 15k pack is up first. It's not going to be a board, sadly. I'm just going to skip that. No one really wants to watch a non-board pack open, let's be honest with ourselves. Who realistically would want to watch that? It's going to be Bothius, who actually looks like he's got a pretty OP card. Now we've got a mega pack, so it's a special card. Uh, sorry, a special pack. We could get something good in this. Um, obviously, I did get my walkout from that. It is going to be something. It's not going to be a walkout. It's going to be a board, though. It's going to be English. Go on, right mid. Hey, Jaden Sancho! I actually predicted that. I don't know. Okay, well, I mean, there was only like five players it could have been or something like that, but that's a good little prediction there. Uh, that's decent. I think he's still like 40-odd K. How much is Jaden Sancho right now? He's currently selling for about 35,000 coins on the PlayStation, and I think that'll rise towards the first weekend league as well. Um, obviously, with rewards, he's uh, he's bound to drop a little bit, but that is a really good pull. I'll happily take that. Um, anything else there? Maybe like a draft token or something? Nothing there. We've got a 50k pack now. Can we get a walkout? Come on, EA. Show me a walkout for George, please. Let's see what we're going to get. It's going to be something. It's going to be a walkout. Is it a walkout in form? French. Goalkeeper. It is a walkout in form. It's Lecomte. Okay. Um, well, I mean, we'll take it. 84 rated in form. That's not too bad at all. Don't think he's selling for anything. I will actually check that. But there could also be like a decent walkout in this pack. For example, there could be like a, I don't know, off the top of my head, like a, a Pogba or something. Um, because obviously the in form will always show up first, having a high discard value. So let's see if there's multiple walkouts in one pack. That would be decent. Have we got anything EA? No, we've not. We've got, we've got one <laughs> walkout in form, which is stored to the transfer list, and then a pack of pretty much nothing. So I think it's probably time to open up Sam's rewards and, uh, and move swiftly onwards. All right, it's time for Sam's rewards now. Uh, he also wanted tradable rewards. Now, he finished in, I think, rank uh, one for Div 4, if I'm not mistaken, which gives him a 35k pack, a 45k pack, and a 50k pack, all three being tradable, of course. So, um, I think that the 15k pack was swapped with the 45k pack from being rank 2 or rank 1 in Div 4. Um, so, we're going to start off with this 45k pack, because in my opinion, this is the worst out of the three packs. We have got at least a board. 
It is just going to be bored, though. No walkout, unfortunately. It's going to be French. Go on, centre back. Goalkeeper, unfortunately. It's going to be Ruffier. You really want centre back if that's going to be French? Because, I mean, Varane, 200,000 coins. Realistically, that's the player you're looking for if it's a non walkout French player. Uh, he's got a bit of Nathan Ake in there, though. Uh, Nathan Ake is obviously selling for a little bit, you know, like 3 4k. Don't recognize anyone else there that's selling for anything, but we'll store them all to the club. Um, now there is a uh, mega pack now, 35k pack. Hopefully we can get some decent in this. These seem to be paying off pretty well today. So that is going to be something. What's it going to be? No walkout, unfortunately, again. It's going to be Dutch centre forward. Centre back. Ooh. Ooh, Delict. Hey, that's decent. I don't know how much he sells for. I have absolutely no idea. I've never checked. 30,000 coin player right there. Bro, the mega packs today have been the one. They have been the, the one that's paid out the most so far today. That is a sick pull. About 30,000 coins this guy's selling for. Roughly around somewhere like that. That is really, really nice. We're storing him on the transfer list. Um, anything like a draft token or anything in the back of the pack? Absolutely nothing. We'll go ahead and discard those two players. Or those two uh, manager items, whatever they're called. Now for the 50k pack and the last pack of the video. If you have enjoyed, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Let me know if you're enjoying the reward content. I'm really excited to have rewards back. And what we got in this last pack. It's not going to be a walkout, sadly. It's going to be a board. It's going to be English score right mid again. Hey, another Jaden Sancho. What an amazing way to end off another Jaden Sancho. Fantastic rewards for Sam today. Um, that is another at least 35k card right there. So 60k in those two cards combined. There could also be some good stuff in this pack. Otamendi. I mean, there's nothing amazing. There's an Otamendi in there. Um, but apart from that... I think he's done really well, actually. Uh, I think he's done really well. I think we've all done pretty well, to be honest, today. If you have enjoyed the video, like I said, leave a like down below. Thank you all for your support recently. And uh, let me know in the comments down below who you got in your rewards. I'll see you lads later.